Uh, Caitlin, get into a building now. Do not come up here. There's an animal outside the radio hut. Get, 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 get into a cabin now. Go. go, go. Oh crap. Outside. I pulled the wire. Stay outside. Fix it. I'll cover you. Nope. Do it now. Go quickly. They look like it was the radio. What is he doing? Oh no! Owie! Nick. Is it safe? I think we're okay for now. We ran into one of those hunter guys. Ah, oh, crap. Yeah, chase us out of the lodge. I think we lost him on the way up here. You get a message out? I think so. What? Who? Caitlin, where's your gun? I lost it. One of the friendly locals wanted to say hi. What the fuck? Did she shoot at us? Who the hell is? Oh, that's the hiker Who's girl. There? She's a badass hunter now. Who was she? Should we follow her? <gasps> oh, it cha changes back to a human after it dies? Oh my god, no way. Am I glad to see you? <laughs> wow. Oh, Jesus Christ! I'm sorry. Oh, you're so annoying. Oh my god, can we please not do this right now? Okay, seriously, I literally came looking for you as soon as I heard there was something out here. Or things, like plural. Wait, really? Whoa. <laughs> Watch out. Oh. Sorry. Sorry? Oh, we knocked her over. Give up. Oh, fuck. Oh, Ow. Ah, ah. Look, you could. Ah. Oh, hey, who is who is that? Who it is? Kaylee Hackett. Mr. H's daughter? Oh. I thought she went home with her mother. He knows who it is. Kaylee. Yeah. I thought so too. Oh man. His Poor daughter. Kaylee. Nick. You smell so good. Oh, you... You all right there, bud? Maybe dial it back a bit, huh? Fuck off, okay. Caitlin. Whoa! He's getting aggressive. <gasps> Watch out! I said get off! <laughs> what the? What's in that water? Are you okay? I just wanted him to stop. Dude! I'm sorry. He's losing control. We need to be keeping a record of everything that happens for the police. Yeah, dead girl in the pool needs some explaining. Easy. Yo, something is not right with that boy. Dude is real sick. Did you see how you freaked out in the water? Abby. Yeah. Of course. Where are you gonna bite you? Like me. I've really enjoyed spending time with you this summer. Such a. Oh, such a. Such. What? Such a cop out answer. Oh, aggression. All his inhibitions are gone. Easy pickings. Oh, right off the bar. This isn't you. I mean, this this isn't you. Ah! <laughs> Holy! He's so hey. strong. Oh, Abby. Uh. Abby, everything okay? Holy shit! Oh 
mine. the shotgun? Yeah. Shoot him? Do it, please! No. What the fuck? I, well, I, what if he could turn? See? What if he could be saved? He can't be saved. He's done for. You all want me to shoot. Of course! <laughs> Okay, now I shoot him. Holy crap! Oh my god! Oh. Holy sh! Her head comes off. Honey, we'll play it again. Jacob's got the thing to fix the car. Oh, shit. Where the fuck is Chris Hackett? Okay. I'm gonna open the door slowly. Just keep your hands up, okay? She won the, with the okay. eye patch? Holy! Ah! Ah! Two lost, Max. We're lost. Three. Hello, my friend. Welcome to the show. What? Oh, she wakes up. This is in the past. So the cop captured her. Oh, he's dragging in the other guy? Is he is he alive? He's alive! He's gonna turn. He's gonna turn. Call out? No. Yeah. Oh, he's swiping. Come here. Come on. I'm in a jail cell. Like, doesn't matter. Get in there. Fucking do it. Was he turning already? He transformed, I think is what that was. You goddamn kids. You transformed why is he alive? You goddamn kids. Hmm. 9 a.m. you done to Max? Shut up. <laughs> you can't just- Shut up! This is an interrogation. I ask, you answer. <clears throat> Name. Compliance? Ooh, what do you want to be, honey? Angry or compliant? Compliant. Mm. Mm. You could bait him. Leave. Get out of here. 
Okay, I'll listen to you this time. Laura Kearney. Who are you traveling with? And what is your relationship? Max Brindley, he's my boyfriend. Where were you headed last night? To Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. You already know this. What have you done with Max? No. I ask, you answer. That's Why? how this works. He knows the answer. Yeah. I'm not saying shit. Well, I'm not saying shit until you tell me where Max is. Is that so? <laughs> you can't keep us here. Is that so? I know what this is. This is an illegal detainment. They are waiting for us at Hackett's Quarry, and pretty soon they're going to figure out we're missing. I want a lawyer. You finished? <laughs> He's, he seems crazy. Sheriff Northkill. Northkill County. Hmm. Maybe I should... Try to appease his ego. Angry, angry. <laughs> Intrigued. Okay, Sheriff. Okay, Sheriff. Hack it. Wait. Hack it? Like, Chris Hack it? Don't change the subject. What the fuck is going on here, man? You have no idea what's going on here. Not a goddamn clue. Sheriff Hackett. You just stepped in some grade A double prime go ahead and kill yourself cosmic type shit, young lady. And your only option is to buckle the fuck up and do what I say. Do you understand? Hmm. Angry or pleading, honey? Stop trying to intimidate me. Always have a thing. Same meaning. <laughs> Stop trying to intimidate me and tell me what the fuck is going on. Is, is Max alive? I feel like I'm going crazy. What? You can't tell what he's thinking. Oh, did we get through to him? No, let's let him do what he's doing. Let's go. Hey. Oh, he changed back because it's morning. Hey, you asshole. He still has his underwear what, what, on. What the fuck's going on? Max! I know you hear me! It's like wolf proof underwear. Fuck. I gotta get me one of those. Concerned. Max! Are you okay? Yeah. You must know. I mean, I'm. I'm kind of all mixed up, but he's all fully more healed. or less intact, I think. Yeah. Laura? I wonder if he escapes and yeah. we fight him. Why am I naked? What? I mean, after we got attacked, the next thing I know, I'm waking up in a jail cell and you're gone. And now you're back again. And, and, and I'm super naked and there's blood and stuff everywhere. I mean, what the fuck happened? This is the coolest werewolf story I've ever seen. It's so good. Hmm. I think he wanted me she to confess. Know yeah. Yeah. So our host was very keen on getting me to confess, but I honestly couldn't tell you what I was meant to be owning up to. Jesus. What he used to try to get you to talk. The Pincher, the blade, three-hole punch? No, it, he wasn't torturing me. Who does this guy think he is? Well, Sheriff of North Kill, apparently. North Kill? Yeah. Max. What? 
Did you even look at the map? Hackett's Quarry in North Kill. That's the town. Oh. <laughs> no, he didn't look. And it gets better. I gotta look at his name badge and... Yeah, I think he's related to the other guy that works at the quarry. Your brothers, maybe. Get dressed. What's he giving you? Not gonna be the guest of honor at Fashion Week, I'll tell you that much. Hey! Did I say you could talk to each other? Should we be smart with them? I kind of want to be. Or if we were compliant, he might just go away and then we can continue to be sneaky. Yeah. Mm, be smart. Laura's smart. Sorry, sir. We'll be quiet. We will? Max? Hey, what'd you do with my real girlfriend? <laughs> the cop didn't expect this. Didn't expect me to cooperate. Hmm. All right, buddy. Hands through the bars. Come on. He's always doing this mouth thing, this cop. Your turn. Let's go. I'm not going anywhere. We can talk right here. Come on. Bit of a duck. Hey. Duck hey. Face. Let's get go. the fuck off. Should, Come on. Move. Wait, shouldn't Max be really strong? Good boy. Hey! Stop struggling. Mm, leave him alone. Hey! Yeah. Leave him alone! Yeah, leave me alone, asshole. Both of you shut up! Fuck you! I said shut up! Hey! Hey, you can't treat us like this! You're hurting it! Hey! Gotta be something in here you can use. Still covered in blood. Something I can use. Oh, who's ro who else was here? <gasps> While the town of North Kill lay there sleeping, the hag in the woods started weeping. As the bodies decay, the wolves hunt their prey, and the sheriff continues his creeping. What is... The sheriff is somehow connected to this, like, ancient lore or something? What the hell's that? A spoon. A bent spoon. Ew. Spoon? I mean, that could be useful. Or there could be ice cream later. Who knows? Always be ready for ice cream. Surprise ice cream is Sis. rare but common. Not a chance. I need some sort of lever. Some sort of spoon shaped metal thing. Ah. Mm. If only. Okay. Why didn't she take it the first time? Oh, yeah, this ought to do it. There, there could be ice cream behind this wall. Ah, yes. Oh. How does this help? You're not gonna fit through that. Common, yeah. Watch it, man. I bruise easily. Not anymore. 
Give me a break, he says, yeah. You have no idea. You're all fully healed. And he's he's more Take fit. The second we get out of here, you're toast, motherfucker. Sure. Damn. The second you get out. What's that supposed to mean, dirtbag? What the fuck is that supposed to mean? Hey! What the fuck is that supposed to mean, asshole? I think he's gonna feed her to the wolves. Or try to. Hey, you can't just leave us in here! Hey! Come back! But I don't think he would. I don't know. Why is he keeping us alive? There's gotta be a reason. Fuck! What do you say, son of a binky bonky? Yeah. Fred, go. Try to cheer him up. How to go in there? You sing like a canary? Nothing to sing about. I'm sure you've got plenty to confess. <laughs> well, that may be true, but I don't think he's too interested in how I cheated off Mikey Washington in eighth grade chem. Really, though, what happened? He, uh, he just asked a lot of questions. A lot of weirdly specific questions about us and where we were going and why and how I was feeling this morning. And I don't know. Nothing I said made him seem any less annoyed. Hmm. He asked how you were feeling? Yeah. Why, he didn't ask you? No. Huh. Rude. <laughs> Rude. How's that whole, the brick thing supposed to help at all? I guess it gives me a brick. And we can hit him in the dick with the brick. Oh, hey, did you get dick. a look at his name badge? The big dick brick. You mean it's not really Detective Dick Whip it? It's Hackett. Sheriff Hackett. You think he's related to Chris Hackett? Oh my god, like THE Chris Hackett? Yeah. Who's THE Chris Hackett? As in camp leader Mr. Hackett of Hackett's Quarry, remember? You don't know anything, Max. Man. Last night feels like a lifetime ago. The fuck does that mean, though? You know? Were we set up? Maybe it's some kind of crazy camp counselor kidnapping ring. That's, I mean, what? Hmm. He's not acting like a kidnapper, is he not? Well, I guess Sheriff Hackett's not exactly acting like a typical kidnapper, but he's not acting like a typical cop either. Well, how do you know how kidnappers act? I'm just trying to get us out of here, and I can't get us out of here until I have some clue of why the fuck we're in here. I don't know. What if we can't make sense of it? What? Well, you we have to. Sometimes things just don't make sense. What then? We're just stuck in a backwater jail cell for the rest of our lives? Hmm. Encourage him? Yeah, he seems like he needs to be uplifted. Laura wears the pants in this relationship. This isn't forever, Max. And the shirt. You, you can't just hold us here forever. He didn't seem too convinced of that. You gotta stay positive. You can't think like that. Why not? Might as well just accept it, right? No, fuck that! Think about the rest of the summer, Max. And school? I mean, I've been dreaming about becoming a vet since I was five years old. I'm not gonna let this fleabag fuckface stop me. We're gonna get out of here. I'm gonna study to be a vet, and you're... gonna... um... What? I'm gonna what? I saw the letter, Max. 
What are you talking about? The rejection letter for college. I found it in your bag. You were poking around in my stuff? Yep. I can't believe you didn't tell me. I... I was embarrassed. But... Your grades were good and you wrote a great essay? Yeah, apparently not good enough. Fuck! You've been making plans, Max. What the fuck? I don't know. What do you want me to say? Hmm. Uh, saying he lied is not gonna help. I was being sarcastic, though. Empathize with him, yeah, sure. I'm sorry, Max. This, this really sucks. Path updated. Hey, it's not the worst thing to happen this summer. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have kept it from you. No. You know you can talk to me about anything, right? Yeah. Yeah, I do. Oh, he appreciates it. Mm. I chose well. Okay, let's just focus on getting out of here for now. Great. Sign me up. We need to go over it from the beginning. Like from when we left home? Like from when we ran into the cop. So Big after we ran mess. into the... That's what you got. Whatever we ran into? Yeah. Actually, yeah, that's when shit started getting weird. Hmm. The dude acted super weird when we said we almost hit an animal. You remember that? It was like he already knew or something. Yeah. Yeah, that was really sketchy. What if he's not even a real cop? <gasps> well, he's got to be dirty, but... I mean, I think he's a real cop. We're in a police station. I mean, yeah, but there's, like, nobody else around. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that is concerning. Especially the whole hack it hack it thing. Let's just go with the idea that they're both in on it. Okay. So we're supposed to meet Chris Hackett at the camp, and instead, there's nobody there, and we get attacked by something, and then the cop shows up. That part's all fuzzy for me. Like, I, I remember the steps and a smell like wet fur and a a dog collar with the name Ian on it. Ian? Ian. Ian. I don't think it was a dog that attacked us. Whatever it was was big. Like, person-sized big. Yeah, it really did a number on you. Like, I'm surprised you're not more messed up. Like, like, like I vividly remember the thing's teeth ripping into you. What is messed up about that is... Laura, I don't have a scratch on me. What? You. Hey, okay, so weird question. Do you remember... Are they gonna figure it before out? Before we got lost? You got lost? Well, yeah, but before that, I was all like, Whoa, look at the moon. It's so big, so cool to see a full moon in the middle of the woods, and you were all like, yeah, no shit, Max, it happens once a month? Yeah, so? Right, so, you know, full moon. Yeah? What if, uh... He's, he knows how crazy <laughs> it's gonna sound. No, stop. I'm just saying, you know, maybe there's a slight chance it was a werewolf. Are you out of your- Goddamn <laughs> mine? Werewolves? Seriously? What the oh, fuck? Well, she's telling him the story. What? 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 What's so funny? I said literally the exact same thing. Okay. Do you, you got anything better? I mean, like, zombies, aliens, mm -hmm. time-hopping Draculas? This is how people would react. That's, that's what I like about the story. Very realistic acting. You wanna answer? Yeah. Ryan, right? Yeah. You want answers? I've got answers. Interrupt me again, you're on your own. <laughs> Oof. Dominant. Whatever. Alpha female. Holy Would shit. it really be so crazy? With all the shit that we've been seeing with Nick? Exactly. With the thing on the roof? You literally okay, watched it happen. Okay, really start to explain a lot of stuff. Dylan, 
I'm just trying to keep an open mind, okay? This is like your ghost stories. How is this so different from your ghost those, stories? Those are those are just campfire stories. Like there has to be a rational explanation the for everything, Ryan. for all of this. He refuses to believe that this could okay, be real. Okay, you were not talking but, so rational when you separated my hand from the rest of my body. You told me to. And if it's bite with which you're faced, cleave limb from torso with great haste. What? What's that did from? the right thing. See? He's got a whole poem about it. <laughs> He's got a damn poem about it. What the hell? There's more to all this than you think. Show me. Just oh. let me finish. Then you can decide for yourself if you believe me or not. I don't care. But I think you should hear all of it. Yeah, there would be people like Ryan, though, that refuse to believe. Like, now nah, it has to be you. The next few weeks were long. Scientific. The cop kept us fed and let us take showers, but aside from that, we barely saw him. He kept them for weeks? Why? Max and I, we talked a lot. As much as we could about what happened that night. It was like trading conspiracy theories. He's working out. He talked about the cop, the camp, the accident. Oh, he probably Lloyd's, can't transform. The thing in the basement. What happened to Max? We just kept going over it all again and again, and nothing was making sense. All we knew is that we needed to get out of there. Hmm. I can't take this anymore. It's not that bad. They're mm. probably in the same crap at camp. No, I can't take being in here anymore. Oh. Yeah, well, that part's pretty tough. We've got to do something. We've got to get out of here. We need a, p a plan. We keep saying that, but it's been weeks, so, you know, let me know if you have one. Mm -hmm. That's really not very helpful, Max. You are forgetting something. What? Just the ETBT. Tiny detail that I may or may not be a fucking werewolf, you Laura. Just keep it down. So what? What can we do, really? We run off into the sunset only to be stopped when I turn into a nasty ass monster and kill you and eat you, and then I run off alone into the sunset with little bits of you stuck in my teeth? Okay, <laughs> okay, stop. Just one problem at a time. All right, we, we don't even know if that's what's really going on, and we won't until we get the hell out of here. Okay. Well, it seems to me that we only have two real options. We can play nice and try to get this guy on our side. What, so he'll let us go? Or we try to catch him off guard and make our escape. Hmm. Catch him off guard, I think. I don't think we can get on his good side. I don't know. You agree, honey? Chat. The chat froze again? It freezes all the time we play this game. It'll come back. Reckless. Uh oh. Reckless. Kind of I think so too. I'm not convinced we can get on his good side. And honestly, I don't think Laura would do it. She would get out at all costs. <laughs> yeah, Jessica can't answer. <laughs> I'm not gonna be nice to this fucker one second longer than I have to. We've got to escape. Cool. Okay. So how? I don't know. Knock him out? Not... Laura, you know that's kind of a movie thing only, right? No, it's not. When you bang someone on the head, you're more likely to kill them or leave them with permanent brain damage, not just knock them out. Well, what can you do? Yeah. True, fuck him. Yes! Prison break! My mama! Prison break it is, or we don't knock his brains out. Well, I'm not 100% convinced he's evil. Don't really want to mash his brains into, you know, potato salad. Although that does sound delicious. Hmm. Determined. Hmm. But what if there's a way to do it without destroying him no we don't knock his brains out nah. 
You want to knock his brains out? Yeah. Okay. But would Laura do that? Uh, if she if she viewed someone as the enemy, then yeah, I think. But like I'm saying, we're not 100% convinced because she was saying like, why is he keeping us here? He's like, you know, treating them relatively well. But just keeping them here. We don't know why. He could be protecting us. I don't know. I don't think we should knock his brains out. I think we should find another way. Okay. Pick on his dick. Yes, exactly. And brain. squeeze the balls. Why you gotta squeeze? No, honey. Yeah. yeah. I think she would be reflective. No more children from you. Bastard. Okay, fine. So we don't knock his brains out. I guess that means send friend request. <laughs> uh. No? <laughs> I wasn't saying that we shouldn't break his head open. Just that we might be doing a whole lot more than knocking him out. Let's just try the non-violent way first. What? So... All right, how are we supposed to get this guy to like us if he won't even talk to us? I don't know. I mean, he's got to have a weak spot, like something we can use. It's not like we don't have time to figure it out. Yeah. Okay. A weak spot. Hmm. Hmm. Family? Hey, hey! T-Money! Can I call you T-Money? Why? You can call me Officer Hackett. Hackett? Like as in money. Hackett's quarry? What's it to you? Just interested is all. Feel like we hardly know you. Well, let's keep it that way, okay? Oh, come on, T-Money. Lighten up, man. No reason we can't be buds, right? I can think of seven. Seven. Understanding. Oh, he hates teenagers and stuff. That's a good choice. You're right. We've been just awful, and we really want to make it up to you. Oh. Hmm. Oh, damn it. I see what you're doing. Well, it's not going to work. You think we're just going to be besties, and I'm going to let you walk right out of here. Not going to happen. Asshole! Max! Well, we know what's going on. Is. We know Max is a werewolf! Uh-oh. Full moon's in a few days, right? What, what then? No, ma'am. You don't know the half of it. Of it. Oh, shit. I what said, take your fucking clothes off. Fuck off. Get oh. back. Max, what's going on? <laughs> Get the fuck away from him. He's going to change. He doesn't want to ruin the clothing. Come here. Get off of me. Shut up. P, get her turn. Have a seat. I was gonna make him make her watch him turn. Quit squirming. Said you want to be a vet, right? Call us an internship. <laughs> Let me go. You're not gonna believe it until you see it for yourself. Yes. Just fucking ask next time, then, dude. Jeez. Don't get too close. T, come in. T. What's your position? Over. Shit. His dad, maybe? Mm-hmm. Just wrapping things up here. Help! Hey, he's got his whole prisoner at the police station! Help us! Who was that? Over. Nothing. <laughs> On my way. Over. Why Nothing. Why are you trying to help you guys? That was pretty stupid. And the dad's probably gonna kill them both if he knows. What if he doesn't know? What if this guy is a rebel? Hey, you can't just leave me here! It was worth a shot. Yes, I can. Ha -ha. So she's gonna watch her boyfriend churn. 
And then he's probably going to try to reach for her. Oh, boy. Take off your clothes. So you can put it back on next time. It looks like Nick, honey, when he turned. Yeah. This is the best werewolf story. <laughs> Clinical. Yeah. yeah, tell me what you're feeling. Max, tell me exactly what you're feeling. Laura, I... I don't feel so good. Not good like how? I don't know, just... Bad. Come closer, let me see your eyes. I think I better stay back. Max, I need to observe you. Is this fucking close enough for you, bitch? <laughs> Yeah, they get all angry. Max? Max? Oh. Wait, what's going on? as well. Well, that's how she gets away. Fuck! Eye is gone. That was suck. That'd be so painful, you know? The reaction is not real. Adrenaline helps you not feel it. back to her cell wait so she got scratched how do how does the infection get Let's spread see that bastard cop fighting probably a bite okay. when to check on a boyfriend wait Doesn't like the steam or what? Oh my god! <laughs> why, do you, why do you attack me when that happens? I have to put it on you, honey. <laughs> <laughs> my heart. It's okay. Yeah. You're okay. Take a moment, honey. Boss. This is cool. Her boyfriend's a werewolf. She can use this. Jesus Christ. She can ride him to school. <laughs> Press all her friends and kill her enemies. Ah. Okay, so that's where I went. My blood trail. Anything else in here? So cool. Oh, there could be cards. I just thought about that. It wouldn't be. I didn't miss cards, did I? I gotta change anything. Almost turning to a fourth area attack. Oh yeah, hear me. Check angles. I don't think there was any angle word back at the, the prisons. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff in it. Oh my god. <laughs> you guys are saying angles, angles. 
I'm looking. I thought so. Angle, honey. In my cell? What's this? Oh, that's the writing. Why am I sitting? Continue looking. Go to sleep. What about that brick? Hey, Bros. Angles again, honey. I, I know. <laughs> I'm looking. In Check. the hole behind the wall? She wouldn't open it. Get out there. Yeah, honey. Honey! I'm... I'm looking for cards. I can't change his angles anymore. And okay, not here, I guess. There you go. The chariot. Nice. Go upstairs. Yeah, I want to go find information. down what's that on the bulletin board huh. 56 boy. oh he's a mama's boy 56 that means he was born in 1965 Let's see now. Nineteen sixty five. All right. Oh, is it coming? This can't be doing too well. A burned badge? A charred sheriff's badge. The old sheriff's badge is badly fire damaged. Does it belong to the current sheriff or one of his predecessors? Family photo. Kaylee's dead. However happy they once were, let's all change now. And Laura killed her. Are they like a whole family of werewolves, maybe? But if that's, we've never seen the sheriff change and he's been out at night. So. Maybe because he's drinking uh, human blood. Yeah, we did see him with blood on his neck that one time. Or drinking animals. Hmm. There's only one thing in here. I need to lie down. You shut up. Mm. What's that? Watch her like pass out and die if I don't lay down. <gasps> Full moon on the 24th. Birthday beers. July 7th. She just learned it's July 7th. So now we know what time, what date it is. What's that? What was that oh, for the... No. All right, the way. <gasps> oh, the syringe. Thank you, <laughs> Thank you. This must be what he used to knock me out. Oh. I can hide this in my cell. Is it already full? No. Yeah, good thing we kept looking, stupid lady. I should go lie down before I can do anything. You shut up.
All right, that's all it's up here. Unless there's a card. At a weird angle. Nope. Okay, we can lie down or check more rooms. Was that in the cell? I think it is. I will say, I think these are some of the scariest werewolves I've ever seen, like in any medium, any story. Locked. They are terrifying. Figures. And dangerous. But I guess I can't leave Max. Better keep snooping, or I could go back to my cell and wait, I guess. Always snoop. Yeah, there's stairs there. That's an exit door. What's this? Nah. What's he hiding? Think we need his birthday? Yeah, maybe. July 7th, 1965. What's he hiding? I don't know. Werewolves? That's my first guess. What's this? Communication. A memo? a memo? What are you hiding, Travis? His name is Travis? A cease and desist letter. A letter instructing those behind the bizarre yet bona fide podcast to stop investigating Hackett's quarry. I can't read that. Oh. Can we see it? Uh... uh. Yeah, that's too blurry for me to read. But I guess the gist of it is people were investigating and they wanted them to stop before they find the werewolves. I might be able to read it if I zoom in. I have exhausted this and myself. I need to sleep. Have you? Have you tried this? Laura's a bit of a quitter, although she is bleeding. Ooh, what's his password? Oh, his birthday! They took everything from me. Hello? They took everything from me. How is the hag of Hackett's Quarry always on the phone at the perfect time? She definitely has mystical powers. they take from her hmm not so much a hint as a slap in the face mm -hmm. you shut up we know the answer <laughs> fuck yeah oh i see i see what she means wow this this computer this is definitely in the 80s. E.T., you heard this shit? We gotta shut it down. Can you handle it for me? Weren't hikers at all, but ghost hunters who went in search of answers and fell victim to the mercy of the hag of Hackett's quarry, never to be seen again. Like us. Except for the fell victim to the mercy of the blah 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 part. We're, we're more like, um, ghost investigators. Specter sleuths? Sure. This is the podcast so, that Ryan listens to? Well, mm. according to reports from the local paper, the North Kill Gazette, some hay bales caught fire during the opening night, and that spread pretty quickly. Before they knew it, the whole place was up in smoke, including the show's leading lady and her alleged baby boy. Ooh, creepy. Holy. Was the phone being weird? And then it just, the video, why? Holy scary. That creeps me out. And then the monitor's going all weird. Brother, I'm getting goosebumps. I died her. Brother, that's scary shit. Uh, 
I'm a little more worried about this witch than the damn werewolves. She's got powers. Oh, the missing cats. Did the cats turn into werecats? Ben Radcliffe and Edward Benson. Wonder who they are. Wait, I want to look at that more. Oh, I'm so concerned about the cats. Look more. Ben Radcliffe. Edward Benson. So those are the hikers. So the guy is in the lake. We don't know where Anne Radcliffe is. I think she probably turned and they were hunting her. Sasha. Oh, there's two cats. Sasha and Digweed. And then dogs. Armin and Perla. Freak show goes up in flames. Hmm. And then there's a harem sanctum poster. Four months on, hiker still missing. Hmm. I really actually hope we meet these werecats. Mm. Something about them is wonderful. Yeah, Digweed and Sasha. <laughs> I guess Digweed's been guilty of digging in the garden. The garden of good and evil. Alright, I think we've seen it all. Very cool. I'll touch, I'll touch this door is the last thing we haven't touched. <laughs> dickweed. Dickweed the cat. So close, right? Yeah. Ooh, scary. That was similar. Alright, let's go back to our boyfriend. See if he wants a belly rub. Honey? Who's, no. who's been a good boy? Who's a good boy? While the town of Northcote lay sleeping, the hag of the woods started weeping. As the bodies decay, the wolves hunt their prey. And the sheriff continues creeping. Mm. I'm not sure what Close to make of that. Honey, would you still love Ross if he was a werewolf? Yeah, honey, would you still be with me if I was a werewolf? Would you, would you try to find a cure? Huh? Or would you shoot me? Well, you have to think about it. Oh yeah. my god. Waiting. I'm thinking if I keep you alive, what I'm gonna do with you? You turn. I guess learn from Laura. This is your training. King, I have to raise chicken. Feed me chickens? Okay. Yeah.